Namaste. I'm going to discuss uh, right now, uh, this is actually how to, uh, it's, it's uh, Wolf's Law. It's uh, where you keep hitting, or not hitting, it's more tapping, it's slow taps. Uh, what it does is it builds up your bone. If you can, you can look it up uh, on YouTube. Obviously it does hurt, but it is good conditioning. Especially to your elbows. You do end up with some bruises. Uh, it's a good way if you uh, want to strengthen, especially if you have weak shins. A lot of people have, like myself, I have weak shins, but you could do this while you're watching TV. Uh, it does hurt. Uh, I recommend it. It's another way to transcend pain in that sense, I, I guess. You start uh, utilizing your breathing to breathe through the pain. Typical Lamaze. Oh uh, yeah, simply all this is, uh, it's, a, it's a shovel handle. Cut down on this. Got a couple of these lying around my house. Uh, also practice stick defense and stick fighting. Uh, instead of having a sword where you can cut yourself. You can only, you know, hurt yourself. Also another one is the head. Because I really find the head, the head butt, is something that a lot of people don't utilize too much. So you might get a bit of a slight headache. They say to put ice on it. I usually don't ice anything. So, but typically with the, when you're doing a headbutt from the front, it's typically here to here. It's like two fingers down from your hairline, and about two fingers or three fingers back, two fingers down uh, back from your hairline as well. And it's not, it's not just lifting the head stuff. It's using your abdomen, abdomen muscles and using your core coming down. And most of the time, you don't really have to, uh, you know, go too far to actually Especially guys up in your face, it's a simple, you won't even see it coming. You know, scratch your nose, like that. Practice that. So there you go, more Neo Shaolin uh, conditioning exercises. Namaste.